Customization is one of the main draws of running an Android phone, and one of the easiest ways to customize the look of your phone is through a launcher. There are several very popular widespread launchers for Android, but one that a lot of people may not know about is the Microsoft Launcher. The Microsoft Launcher will immediately give you a very refreshed, modern look to your home screen. It offers a very different experience than some of the other launchers available on the Play Store and overall gives a polished Windows 10 on your Android phone kind of look. Visually and interface wise, the Windows 10 experience really jumps out at you when you install this launcher and notice the high definition backgrounds, which are powered by Bing and were also used on Windows 10. Those people that are familiar with this know that the Bing backgrounds offer an eclectic selection of vistas and HDR photography. There's usually a little caption on the bottom of each background as well to tell you where the photo was taken. The photo selections are quite good, vivid, and offer a variety of HDR vistas for your viewing pleasure. For the app tray on this launcher itself, one of the coolest features is wiping up from the bottom gives you access to the phone's controls, which is a feature that's found on iOS, but not so much on Android. Here you can access stuff like airplane mode, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and of course the flashlight. This is a very welcome design touch, which makes controlling your phone a lot easier, particularly if you're using it in one hand mode. Another nice touch to these rotating backgrounds is a quick access menu with a change background button. With just one swipe and a press of one of this button, you can instantly change to another HDR background. One of the key features of the Microsoft Launcher is the glance menu, which can be accessed by swiping left on the home screen. Here it contains your tray for widgets, news, and your timeline. These menus are fully customizable and you can have different widgets depending on which apps you have installed on your phone. Some of these widgets are genuinely helpful and convenient as stuff like the clock widget allows you to access your timers and your alarms with a quick swipe left as opposed to trying to find the app through the app tray. The news feed is actually very well done. Much like the rest of the launcher, the interface is quite polished and has a very Windows 10 vibe to it, with tiles that resemble the tiles that we used to see on Windows 8. The transparent theme really adds to the Bing Daily wallpapers, which adds an overall aesthetic touch when scrolling through the news on this launcher. The Microsoft Launcher also boasts a fully designed and implemented gesture system where various gestures allow you to trigger certain actions or sets of apps on the phone. This is also fully customizable and quite an advanced feature for a completely free launcher. Gestures include swipe up, swipe down, two finger swipe up, swipe down, and a host of others. Also found in the launcher settings are the home screen settings, which allow you to customize the look of your home screen through a variety of menus. Here you can change things like the icon size, the font size, the amount of padding around the icons, and also the number of columns and rows on your home screen. Going a little bit deeper into the home screen layout and you'll find adjustments for things like the notification badges where you can change the appearance notification badges. The list goes on with the home screen customizations as you can even adjust whether or not you want your icons to be shown in a horizontal and or vertical grid. While these features aren't unique to the Microsoft launcher, it's definitely well executed here. The search function is also very well implemented on this launcher as the search bar is present on most screens of the launcher and you can customize the appearance in the launcher setting menu. You can also place the search bar on the top of the page or at the bottom of your phone which comes in handy for one hand operation. You also have the option of removing it altogether. Surprisingly enough even though this is a Microsoft product, you can customize the search engine that's used for the default search on the search bar present on most screens on this launcher. 
So here are my overall thoughts on this launcher. With the Microsoft launcher, you get a lot of the polish that you would come to expect from the company. Animations are smooth, nothing is very buggy, and it's overall a very well implemented piece of software. So if you're looking to give your Android phone a nice snappy refresh, or have used Windows phones or Windows 10 in the past, you'll feel right at home with the Windows launcher. Available for free on the Play Store.